is a milestone we have achieved today uh, to construct a pipeline, uh, a railway that was abandoned for many years. And now we can see a railway bringing uh, products, uh, petroleum products, uh, from uh, Thika to Nanyuki. This is good uh, progress uh, as far as this Jubilee government is concerned. I want to thank those who participated. All the actors, Kenya Pipeline, uh, Railways, uh, the government of uh, Laikipia, for the effort they put in a record six months implementation of this project. And I've just been told this took us, this ramp took us 14 days. This is truly efficiency. What does this bring us to uh, as far as the petroleum sector is concerned? It brings us efficiency, the security of our products is going to be achieved with this railway. It's going to be cheap. It's going to be safe. We're taking away trucks off our roads. Today alone we've taken over six trucks uh, times two. We'll talk of maybe 20 trucks. That is traffic. That is uh, safety on our roads. And for trucking cargo, Many a times we talk of uh, adulteration of our products. Uganda sometimes complains and other countries. But if there's a pipeline or a railway, it means security of our products is achieved. I want to thank those who supported us in this project. A record 1.8 billion was spent on this project. I know I cannot talk of how much the county government has put and the time all of us have put in this. But thank you, Kenya Pipeline for giving us 1.8 billion that has helped us achieve this milestone. This milestone is going to help us in terms of other sectors. The agricultural sector around Mount Kenya region is going to, to benefit. And I must say something today. The mining sector that talks of bulk minerals, iron ore, manganese, and many other pro uh, many minerals we find in, the, in this region will benefit from this railway. Mining and, uh, and railways go hand in hand. The same way this petroleum uh, sector is going to benefit from this. We will see sa southern Ethiopia an opening of uh, the northern frontier benefit from this railway. And I want to thank the governor for finding the lost, uh, understand the lost map <laughs> that disappeared around Nanyuki. Now we'll be able to find that map, I mean uh, implement that plan, take the railway down to Meru, and of course it will end up in Isiolo and eventually linking the Lapset uh, project. Sometimes back, uh, idea was muted for us to look at the expansion of uh, our network and uh, those of you who have been looking have been seeing the shell network has been expanding and one of the key areas that came was the Mount Kenya region. Uh, in this region alone we are already at 20 service stations as uh, shell service stations and it's spreading. And uh, due to this increase and the potential that is presented by uh, many projects, uh, of course the big uh, counties that are in uh, Mount Kenya region, but also we had projects like the Lapset project. We saw it was an opportunity for us to uh, provide the security of supply for fuels, and that's where the idea of this depot came in. We approached definitely the, our ministry and the government uh, to try and see what concession was available for us to bring this depot. And uh, even then, the whole idea was, once we have a facility like this, it's not uh, for competition purposes. It is for supply security. And as such, these facilities, we don't compete. We bring them, and when need be, they are utilized for the entire community. And uh, I'm glad to say that the whole idea that we have today, as you see here today, is to convert this facility into a common user facility and if you want to know what that means, it's a facility that can be used by any, anybody, which means any oil company, 
that is willing to come in to put their fuel here, they can use it and supply the fuel. What that means, it will bring a lot of uh, benefit to the community around in that, uh, first of all, <coughs> the facility of 12 million liters is enough to turn around uh, with the efficient transportation that we've seen with the installation of the railway and supply the entire of uh, the counties within Mount Kenya region. 